Hello everybody, my name is Lori Campbell and I'm the owner of Level Up with Lori, a Pilates-based fitness, wellness, and lifestyle brand. I'm so honored to be here today to lead you through a warm-up before today's event. We would also like to say a special thank you to the Lazarex 544K event sponsors. Let's go ahead and get started. So we're gonna start standing. We're gonna take our legs wide apart, a little farther than the hips. We're gonna reach up and over, reaching up and over, big sweeping motions here with the arm for four and three, two. Now we're gonna take that across our body, adding a little torso twist here as we warm up for four, three. Now we're gonna take it to the floor. Little taps here, right and left as we lunge. If that's too much, just stay right here. Okay, taking it back through the center for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Now reach it up, we're gonna go for four. Across for four. Down for four. Back through the center for four. Now we're taking it twos, up for two, reach, across, and down for two, and center one more time in twos, reach, take it across, down to the floor, back through the center. Now from here we're going to reach, take a little bend in the knees, reach, down, up, little squat at the bottom, four more, extend the arm and the leg, and down, reach. Two more here, two. Now from here, we're gonna round through our spine. Round through your spine, and then flatten your back. Again, round. A little spinal mobility here, again, round it up. Flatten it down. One more, round it up. And then flatten it down. Now we're gonna take that on the left, so left. We reach and bend, reach and bend. Four more here, for four. And three, two, last one, we'll stay down. Let's round through that spine. Tuck the chin to the chest, then flatten the back. We round and flatten. Two more of these, two, and flatten. One more, we round it up, we flatten it down. From here, we're gonna place our hands on the floor. Go ahead and straighten those legs. Shake out that head right and left. Taking another bend in the knees, letting the arms just hang as we roll and stack the spine. Now we're gonna reach both arms up. We're gonna reach it all the way to the sky. Flat back and swan dive our body forward. We're gonna bend our knees at the bottom, and then we're gonna slowly roll back up in four counts. Four and three. A little faster now, and we'll take it up for two. Flat back for two. Bend at the bottom for two. We roll it up for two. Again, reach. Flat back down. Bend at the bottom. Roll it up. Again, we reach. Flat back. We bend at the bottom. And then we're gonna roll it up, stacking that spine. Perfect. Okay, from here, we're gonna take those toes and turn them out. So again, my stance is a little wider than my hips. Toes are turned out to the sides. We're gonna take a deep squat here, all the way down, reaching those arms long, and then coming back up. If the arms ever get to be too much, place them right here. Take it down, opening those thigh bones to the back of the room, knees are tracking over our toes. We're gonna to take it down in two counts, and then up for two counts. Warming up through the legs and that lower half. A little faster, take it down, and up, and down, and up, two more. Two, one more. Now let's stay at the bottom and add some little baby pulses here. We've got four more. Now we're gonna to start to reach our right arm overhead. We're gonna reach, reach and pull. Reach, working into the side body, over. We've got four more of these. Reach, really trying to move the torso. Two more, two, one. Back to a T, left arm, we reach and pull. Reach and pull. Three, four more here. For four, trying to stay low with the hips. Three, and two. We're coming back to a T. Pulses again, take it down and down. Relaxing those shoulders. 
for four and three. We're gonna try and hold it low. If you need a break, just come up to standing and take the hands to the hips. For four and three. We're gonna start to lunge over to the right. So we're taking it to the right, dropping that left knee, coming back through the center, over to the left, back through the center. Over to the right, back through the center, to the left, and center. Let's try that a little faster. Right, center, left, center, right, center, left. We've got four more. Four, three, two, one. We're gonna take it to the right. Hands can just be on our hips. Little pulses here. We've got four more for four and three. Let's take it through the center. Pulses for eight. Eight and seven, six, five, four, three. Taking it over to the left for eight and seven, six, five, four, three. Last set. Arms go out, reaching out. And then we're gonna take our arms up towards the sky for four and three and two and one. Yes, straightening. We're gonna take it all the way down to the floor. Again, bending those knees, letting the head hang, and then slowly rolling ourselves all the way back up to standing. Okay, from here, we're gonna to start to roll our shoulders back eight times for eight and seven, six big shoulder shrugs for four, three, two, one. Now reverse it, take it forward. We've got four more. Four, three, two, one. Now from here, big circles back. One more slow. Big stretch through the shoulders. Little faster for four and around. Three, two more, two, and one. Now reverse it slow. Reach it all the way around. Reach one more time, big reach. Four more, faster. So it's four and around and three. Two more, two, good, and one. Hands back here, we're gonna reach right and left. Little isolations here with the upper body, four and three and two, one. All the way, big side body stretch to the right. Feeling that elongation on the left side of the body. We're gonna come into a flat back, reaching out through those arms. Legs are straight, spine is straight. Now from here, we're gonna come all the way down, hands to the floor, nose towards our knee. Breathing through all of this, we're gonna come through the center. Again, bend the knees here to protect the back as we roll all the way up, arms to a T. Let's take it to the left, up and over. Big side body stretch. Think of separating the ribs from the hips, then move into a flat spine. Flat spine, reaching out through those arms. Legs are straight for four, three, and down, all the way, nose towards our knee. Good, we're gonna come through the center. From here, hands are gonna stay on the floor. We're gonna bend our knees and start to shift our body right and left. So we're gonna lunge over to the right. And my toes are facing forward. Let's take it to the left for four, three, two. Back to the right for four, three, two, and to the left, just warming up through the inner thighs here. Now we're gonna single it out eight times. So it's eight and seven, just shifting our weight right and left, four more, for four, and three, two, and one. Now from here, we're gonna turn our entire body over to the right so that we hit a runner stretch. Staying here for a second. For four, think of a long spine. Then we're gonna straighten both legs to the top. I want you to think about squaring off those hips, dropping the head down, trying to bring that thigh towards your chest. For four and three, two and one. This time we're gonna come back to that lunge, but we're gonna let that bottom knee hit the floor. I want you to take your hands, if you can, right to your thigh, and then push those hips forward. So we get a nice stretch through the hip flexor here. Maybe that left arm reaches towards the back wall. Just a moment. Intensify that stretch. Then we're gonna take our hands to the floor, shift the weight back, flex through that right ankle, and go ahead again, lay your chest towards your thigh. Four, three, two, one. Now from here, we're gonna shift the body forward, back into that lunge. 
taking the hands to the floor on either side of the ankle, we're gonna shift back that right leg. So here we are in a plank. Four more counts here for four, three, two, one. We're gonna take the right leg forward and back. Pull it forward, press it back. Forward and back. Four more of these, trying to maintain that plank, coming to the knees if we need to. Two more, two, one more. Now we're gonna take a little lift, 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 looking into the glute. Now we're gonna combine the two moves. So knee, lift, knee, lift, back. Four, three, last two, and one, holding our plank for four, three, two, and one. Let's come to the knees. Take it back, give yourself a little child's pose for four and three, two, and one. Now from here, we're gonna separate the knees slightly. A little wider than the hips, hands are about the width of the shoulders. We're gonna shift our body forward, take a push up, press ourselves back up, and then back to our child's pose. So we shift forward, those shins can just stay on the floor, push up, press, and then take our body back. Taking it forward, all the way down, push up, take ourselves all the way back. Again, shifting forward, taking ourselves all the way down, pushing back up. Let's just take one more of these, belly really drawn in, press, and then take it back. Yes, again, those knees are gonna come together for child's pose. We're gonna come up, we're gonna take that right leg forward again. Press through that left leg, straightening the legs. We're gonna come through the center, take a second just to shake the head out right and left. Four counts for four, and three, two, and one. Let's lunge over to the left. So we've got our traditional runner stretch here. Four, three, two, and one. And we're gonna straighten those legs, nose towards your knee, for four, and three, two, and one. Then we're gonna come down. Down all the way to the knee this time. Relax that foot, bring your body up, hands right on the thighs, push, push, push forward, taking that right arm, reaching up and over to the back wall to intensify that stretch. Then taking the hands to the floor, flex through that left ankle, shift the weight back, drop the nose towards the knee, really lengthening through that left leg. And then from here, we're gonna shift forward again into our lunge and find that plank position. So we're coming forward, pushing through that right foot. Hands are on the floor. The left leg is gonna come back this time. Now we're gonna to start to pull that left knee forward for eight. So it's eight. Forward. Pull it forward. Forward, we've got four more. For four, and three, and two, and one, now we have our arabesque lifts for eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Let's combine them. Pull it forward, forward, lift, forward. Six more here for six and five, four, three, last two. And then we'll take a rest, one more. Coming down to our child's pose. Giving ourselves a moment here for four, three, two, and one. We're gonna take the knees apart, but this time our hands are gonna stay almost together. Thumbs are touching. We're gonna move into a tricep push up. So we're gonna shift our weight forward, trying to keep the elbows close into the rib cage, push ourselves back up, and then shift that weight back. So coming forward, tucking the tail under, low belly in, shoulders away from those ears and then press ourselves back. Let's see four more of these. So shifting forward, taking it down and up. We have three more. And shift forward, take it down, press it up. Two more here. And shifting forward, take it down. Good, pressing it up. One more of these, shifting forward, dropping it down, pushing it up, and then coming back into our child's pose. Knees can come together. We're gonna shift our body forward back into that lunge. So the left leg comes forward, pushing through that right leg. Let's go ahead and straighten the legs. We're gonna come through the center and take a shoulder opener here. So we're gonna grab our hands, clasp the hands together. Let that shape fall towards the wall in front of you. Looking to the right. And then we'll look to the left for four. 
coming back through the center, dropping the arms, and then rolling our body all the way up to standing. Let's just take a little neck stretch here. So bringing the feet together, hand on top of the head, really push down towards the floor with that other arm. Little neck stretch here. And then switching to the other side, hand on top of the head, reaching towards the floor with that other arm. Slight tilt of the chin of the ear towards the shoulder. Good. And then we're going to take our hands at the base of our neck and just kind of fold the neck forward so that we're really stretching into that upper trap. And then we're going to extend the chest towards the sky. Just two more of those. So kind of round the body forward and then open up to the sky. Good. We have one more. Rounding forward and then opening the chest to the sky. Last little set here. Legs apart. We're going to reach up to the sky, kind of how we started, and then flat back all the way down. Bending at the bottom, holding for four, and then slowly rolling up in four, four, three. Now we're going to take that two times through in two. So up for two, flat back for two, bending at the bottom for two, rolling our body up. Last one, reaching to the sky, flat back down, bending at the bottom, and then rolling our body up. Yes, I hope that you're warmed up and ready for your event. If you'd like more Pilates-based fitness videos like this, make sure to check out my website, which is levelupwithlori.com, and also check me out on Instagram, at levelupwithlori. Thank you, everybody.